Hello and welcome to Web Learning with Knowledge You Shared. In today's video, I'll continue where I left off from having an AWS server running Ubuntu. And in today's video, I'll show how to set an open VPS server. So the first thing we need to do is update our server. So sudo apt update. Then sudo apt upgrade. Click yes. So I'll clear this window. So there are different methods to install OpenVPN. You can do it either manually or you can use a script. Uh, I'll use a script at this time. I'll put a link in the description below. So we get git io vpn minus o openvpn install sh. Permission denied because we need to do it as a administrator. So sudo we get then sudo bash to install the OpenVPN. Now it's starting to ask me a bunch of questions. So this is my public IP address that we saw. Which protocol? I'm going to use UDP, so it's going to choose one. Click enter. What port? If you remember when we set the Ubuntu, we had this port open, so click enter. Which DNS do we want to use? So you can either leave it at one or change it to Google. Let's use Google. And this is if you want to have a client, then just leave it as it is. And now we'll do the server. And that's it. So I clear the screen. To make sure if the service is running or not, you can do sudo service open VPN status. So as you can see, it's not active. Let's start it. So the same open service, open VPN start. And we'll go back and see the status and we can see it's active. Okay, so now we need to use the file that was generated by the open VPN in order to connect to the, our server. So the easiest way to do that using also Total Commander is first of all going to the OpenVPN server, cd slash etc slash OpenVPN. If we do ls, we can see the client and server. Now the OpenVPN file is at a bit tricky folder that for the total commander will be hard to reach. So what you need to do is sudo cp for copy. The file location is at, is at tilde forward slash. You can see the file now, it's called client open VPN. So we can do star dot o VPN to the current location. Now if we do ls again, we can see that we have the file. Now let's go to our total commander. So now that we are connected using our VPN, you can watch the video how to do this. I'll leave a link up here. We can go to etc, open VPN, and here's our client file. Okay, we can copy this, and now we can disconnect, as there is no need anymore for the files. In order to connect, we need to install the OpenVPN GUI. To start the service, open the VPN, click on import file, use the file that you've imported, and then right click and connect. That's it, everything is now connected to your server. One important thing that you can do when you build this server, you can change where your server is located. Now, if you're playing games like Fortnite, you can choose the server to be in Europe under Frankfurt or at other places that you can search where is the best way to connect to it. This way you can have your own VPN server that you can use when you travel or when you play games without paying anyone. There could be some restrictions on this or data restriction that I don't know for now. But if you do, please leave your comments below. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to click subscribe and the notification bell so you'll see when I'm, so no one releasing new videos. Thank you.